Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this very exciting video of algebraic challenging equations, we will be solving an interesting radical algebraic equation. Fifth root of 512 plus square root x plus fifth root of 512 minus square root x equal to 4. So let's get started. As you can see, square root is involved. Square root x, square root x, x cannot be negative. One thing is clear. For real solutions, x should be greater than 0. Now I am going to give substitution. I will consider the first radical, this whole term as a and second whole term as b. So I can write few equations. Let me write equation number 1 here. So I will write a plus b equal to 4. This is our first equation. Now come to second equation. Because of a is fifth root of, so I can write a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to. So 512 plus square root x, 512 minus square root x. So it will become 1024. 512 plus 512. So these two equations are confirmed. Equation 1 and equation 2. Now I am going to consider the fifth power of equation 1. I am going to write a plus b whole power 5. Expansion. So let me write this expansion but before that we should requirement of the coefficient. So I am using Pascal triangle. So immediately we can write like this quickly. 4, 6, 4, 1 and our required row is 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1. These are coefficients of our expansion. So let us write a power 5 plus 5 a power 4 b plus 10 a cube b square plus 10 a square b cube plus 5 a b power 4 plus last term is b power 5. Now I will consider the first and last term all together and a plus b equal to 4. So I will write in LHS it would be 4 power 5 equal to a power 5 plus b power 5 which is 1024 plus I am going to consider this term and 5 term this one all together and what I can take common that is 5 ab so it would be left with a cube plus b cube similarly for 10 I can write 10 a square b square common in bracket I will be having a plus b ok now what is 4 power 5 4 power 4 is 256 4 power 5 is 1024 so this term and this term will get over so one side we are having 0 ok so because of one side is 0, I can cancel this number and this number. Here I can write 1, here I can write 2 because one side is 0. So ultimately equation becomes AB AQ plus BQ plus 2 times A square B square times A plus B which is equal to 0. This looks like good equation, comfortable equation. Okay. Now I am going to put few values. A plus B, 4 I will put. Here I can do anything, nothing. So A cube plus B cube. I will take expansion. I will write A B. Algebraic expansion of A cube plus B cube. A plus B. In second bracket, A square plus B square minus A B. This is what we know. On this position, we can write this expansion. Okay. 
a plus b is 4 so let me write here 8 a square b square equal to 0 okay again i will write a plus b equal to 4 so it will become 4 a b okay first two th brackets a b and a plus b is 4 a b a plus b is 4 so 4 a b a square plus b square i can write a plus b whole square plus 2 ab is extra so i have to take away so minus 2 ab minus ab minus 3 ab plus 8 a square b square done now let me put here a plus b again 4 so it will become 4 ab or let me remove 4 also because right hand side is 0 so i can eliminate this 4 also i can write ab in bracket i will write 4 square so 16 minus 3 ab and this way this term would be 2 a square b square in next step i am going to write minus 3 a square b square plus 2 a square b square so minus a square so let me write if you want otherwise we can write in the next slide that is 16 ab minus a square b square so it will become 16 ab minus a square b square is equal to 0 i am going to take ab common out so 16 minus ab remember what we considered ab this was our a this was our b now ab either ab equal to 0 or 16 minus ab equal to 0. Now what is ab? Either we can solve this way a plus b is 4. So we can make two equations ab equal to 0, a plus b equal to 4. We can solve for a and b. Similarly, ab from second equation I can write ab is equal to 16, a plus b is 4. We can solve like this or we can find out ab here from our consideration so let me find out ab that would be i guess easier so ab would be you can see a is fifth root of 512 plus square root x times fifth root of 512 minus square root x okay product so i can write fifth root of 512 square minus x this would be our ab a plus b the difference of square formula a plus b times a minus b so that exponent will be common okay so i will substitute value one by one a b equal to zero let me consider this one first so i will write fifth root of 512 a square minus x equal to zero raise both sides power five so it will become 512 is square minus x is equal to 0 or x is equal to 512 whole is square. This is our x which is acceptable value. It is positive. In terms of base 2 means 2 power we can uh, 512 is 2 power 9. So I can write 2 power 9 whole power 2. And by exponent property, I will multiply these two. So it will become 2 power 18. X is equal to 2 power 18. Now come to second equation. AB equal to 16. Let me write here. AB equal to 16. What was our AB? AB was fifth root of 512 is square minus X. So I will write here fifth root of 512 a square minus x equal to 16. Now I will take raise power both sides 5. So I will I will get 512 a square minus x is equal to 16 power 5. 16 power 5 we can write 2 power 4 whole power 5. So 16 power 5 will become 
20. 4 times 5 is 20. Okay, so it is 2 power 20. What about 512 square? So if I will write this one, then it is 2 power 9 whole square minus x is equal to 2 power 20. So this is 2 power 18 minus x is equal to 2 power 20. So x will become 2 power 18 minus 2 power 20 which is negative number. So rejected. The domain of the equation was x positive. And why it is? Because of the square root. Okay. Now come to verification part. What, what is the only answer? That is, let me write here x is equal to 2 power 18. Let's verify. So I will write here very, very poor handwriting verification. Okay. x is equal to 2 power 18. So I will write here 512 plus 2 power 18 square root. So it will become 2 power 9. Okay. Fifth power plus. Fifth power 512 minus 2 power 9. Now we know that 512 is 2 power 9. Both are same. So this square root, fifth root will be 0. What is left? So it would be 2 power 9 plus 2 power 9 whole power 1 over 5. So 2 power 8, what you will write? 2 power 9 you will take common? No. 2 power 9 times 2. 2 power 9 if you will take common, then in bracket it would be 2. And whole power is 1 over 5. So 2 power 10, whole power is 1 over 5. 2 power 2, answer will be 4. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. And x is equal to 2 raised to the power 18 is the only solution of this radical equation. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video.